All right, what's going on, everyone? Chris Chess Sports Cards here. We are doing 2024 Tops Heritage Third Case Break number 129. Welcome, 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 everybody. Uh, most of these spots were sold on the web. I think we did the last eight spots we did on eBay tonight. So, as always, for those of you who bought on the website, I do truly appreciate it. Um. So, well, let's do our spiel anyway, because we do have some eBay people here, too. Anyway, welcome, 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 especially if you're new to the channel, welcome. A bit about us, we've been around for over six years now. We break mostly baseball. We ship all cards from every break. We're very generous with the top loading, and we ship as quickly as our little hands will move. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. eBay continues to run their sweepstakes. There's no purchase necessary there. Go to any of our eBay listings, look in the description at the very top. There's a link, click on that. Mm. Follow what it says, and you can win some free cards. And as always, go and check out ShiftSportsCards.com. Our pride and joy. Anyway, Robert, what's up, buddy? Right, let's go over the teams. Uh, D-backs, Robert H. Braves, Jacob C. Orioles, Matthew T. Red Sox, Jacob C. Cubs, Ben A. White Sox, Kevin H. Reds, Adam S. Uh, Guardians, Rockies, Tigers, Kevin H. Royals, Brian R. Astros, Kevin H. Angels, Bryce T. Dodgers, Michael Y. Brewer, uh, Brewers, John T. And Twins, Chris F. Marlins, Kevin H. Mets, Rich L. Yankees, Andrew P. A's, Rich L. Phillies, Matthew T. Pirates, Robert H. Cardinals, Craig K. Padres, Robert H. Giants, Michael Y. Mariners, Bryce T. Rays, Robert H. Uh, Rangers, David B. And Blue Jays and Nationals, Kevin H. All right, let's open some cards. And my lights look dark. Hold on a sec. They weren't turned up all the way. There we go. One light gets so weird sometimes. Like when I turn it all the way up, it starts to like flicker for some reason. I don't know strange all right who do we got tonight for the yankees elliot maddox one of yankees manager Vern's most controversial moves in 20 in 1974 was inserting elliot in the center field and moving bobby mercer to right elliot responded with a superb hitting and flawless fielding there you go for the yanks uh andrew go bud All right, here we go. Good luck, everybody. Hope everybody's had a wonderful, relaxing Sunday. Come back to work tomorrow for most of us. Came an arrow rookie. Chrysler launches the first automobile rebate. Oh, yeah, we had that one. That's right. You get 200 back on a car that was 3500 bucks. And De La Cruz rookie. Uh, low short print for the Rangers. Waller 
rookie. Max Scherzer. Wait. And but my microphone. Uh, Freddie Freeman, New Age Performers and DS. Chris, what's up, buddy? What's going on in your neck of the woods? Anything? Did you go to Days yet? You moved back to Days? Or is it still got some time before that happens? Mm, Gavin Williams, rookie. Gordis Goriel, low numbered. One's working here tonight. Let's see. What we got going here? Oh, okay. Uh, Tommy Henry for the D backs. Uh, 486 of 999. Robert? No, I didn't. I didn't see that. You want the Jaws card? Okay. I'll, uh, I know Andrew wants an Apache Hut card. Chris wants a Jaws card. I'll, uh, I'll do the best I can. I'm sure I can come up with some of them for you guys. Uh, Palmer and Gibson. The Apache one I actually set aside already, but I, I think... I don't know, let's see if I have a Jaws one around. If not, the next one I find. We'll make sure it gets to you, Chris. What's this? Uh, Ty France, low numbered. So wait, the Tiger Twins game where McKinstry on the Tigers made an error at third, then gave up a three-run homer in pitching. No, I didn't see it. So um, tomorrow we're going to do the big league blaster break tomorrow night. A lot of you guys are in that. Um, now, the only other thing is the heritage blaster, which is more than halfway full. Uh, Adley and Cabrera. Because of the ban on retail, I can't post the final teams on eBay like we did with, like I do with these. So. We'll have to see. We'll have to get those. We'll reduce the price on some of them. Get those last teams sold so we can do that this week too. Alexi Diaz. Zach Geloff, rookie. Emerson Hancock. Jason Dominguez, rookie. And... Uh, for the Dodgers. That is the, which one is that? The missing signature? I'm sorry, these things are. Yeah. That's the missing signature parallel. See how there's no facsimile signature on it? Uh, which are one every 275 packs. For the Doyers. Michael, Michael Y. There you go, buddy. Yeah, well, let's get some parallels. Let's get some autos. I was really, that last case was, this is a fresh case we're starting here, so. The last case really sucked. 
be honest with you. I mean, we had some good variations, parallels and stuff, but, and that is the Luis Matos rookie image variation for the Giants. Nice one there. Uh, Michael, you're on a roll, buddy. It's a Michael box. Giants, Luis Matos, image variation rookie. Back to back for Michael. There you go, buddy. Nice. So let's, uh, let's make sure this, let's hope this case is better than the last. We had two autos in that whole case in the, in the first one we had. That's absurd. Uh, Matt Manning low numbered. Hey, and there's a black bordered Anthony Descalfini for the Mariners to 50 copies for Bryce. See, now look at this like four packs in a row we've had numbered cards, black border cards, a couple of variations. This is a much better case already. <laughs> Ryan, uh, Justin Steele, and Henry Davis, rookie. Adam Frazier. You know what does seem odd about Heritage this year? And again, we've... We're just into our second case now, but the rookies seem very limited. I was doing sorting today, and uh, again, it used to always kind of be like that. You were kind of guaranteed one in a hobby box, but it's not the case. Uh, Josh Jung for the Rangers, white border uh, for David. Like, I was doing one, I was sorting one of the breaks. I think it was Fridays. I was sorting this afternoon. And there wasn't a single Henry Davis rookie in four boxes. There were a couple guys who, there was nothing at all. There was, like, one Sal Freilich. I think there was two Dominguez and two um, De La Cruz, which seems to be kind of, it seems like they're every other box. But in the past, they used to be a little more... And again, I wonder if that's by design or not. It just happens to be the case that I got or if they're trying to limit rookies a little bit. Eli Morgan, low numbered. Guess what? It's a relic. Hey, Oscar Hernandez for Seattle Clubhouse Collection. You know, look, I mean, usually with Heritage, I'm fine if it's like 8, 4, 7, 5, you know, uh, relic to auto, but 10 to 2 is not. And again, they need to make a better relic colors to it. And not that the Clubhouse Collection ones are horrible, but they're just, I don't know, kind of old. They could put more into it without having to spend a dime more, you know. Uh, for Bryce. Here you go, buddy. Nice to see Oscar Hernandez. Uh, 
Uh, Rangers World Series, Gunner. Reed Marlowe. Michael Kopech, low numbered. And white bordered Xander for the Padres. Parker Meadow with a busted corner. A severely busted corner. Xander's for Robert. <clears throat> All right, box number two. And the Tay Oscar goes too. <laughs> I just got that. <laughs> That's funny, Michael. <laughs> Look at Yogi back in the day. Looking like a young man. He's looking like he got a bit of a die job going right there. I know he's got a hat on, but. <laughs> Look at that career. 46 to 65. Lifetime 285. 358 home runs. 1430 RBIs. 2,150 hits. That's quite a career, man. For the Mets. For the Mets. I prefer the buybacks. Even if it's some guy nobody ever heard of. I just think they're fun to get the old cards. They retired his number today. Really? Mike Gooden, man. He was my guy back in the day. He was the one we were always searching for. <laughs> There's the Apache. Uh, Sandoval, low numbered. Wake Gooden was no joke, man, back in the day. Hey, an autograph for the White Sox, Jim Cat. Let's get the White Sox. Kevin from the eBay pickup tonight. Jim Cat. See if there's any oh, no fun facts about Jim Cat. Anyway, there you go. Real one auto Jim Cat for the White Sox. Uh, Soto. So we need a case or two of that. Remember last year, some of the heritage cases we got where we'd get like five hits in a box and, you know, all kinds of fun stuff. We need some of that this year. Uh, Patino, low number. I mean, what good is a good heritage break without a nice quarter card or... <laughs> A postage stamp and a quarter from 1975. <laughs> uh, Trey Turner and... Ah, who do we got? Fred Lynn for the Red Sox and Joe Morgan for the Reds. Red Sox is Jacob and the Reds is Adam. So we'll have to roll a die on that guy later. This is a white-bordered short print.
Logan Webb for the Giants. Numbered 406 of 575. It's hard to pick up a little. It's actually a really nice looking card. Uh, for Michael. Then and now, Morgan Acuna. What was sweet? I didn't even see it. Uh, Severino, low numbered. Justin Steele and Matt Dose. Uh, Devers New Age Performers. <laughs> <clears throat> And Doval, low numbered. There's Bryant, Sheehan, and Soderstrom. Lynn and Yoshida, then and now. Juan Mirashell. You certainly have pulled him before. Uh, Corey Jolts. Low number. Luciano rookie. Uh, Bobby Miller. Uh, there's the Show and dice error card for the Cardinals. Marte rookie Garcia, short numbered, low numbered, short, low, short number, short, low number, whatever. And Gregory Soto, white border for the Phillies. For Matthew. <laughs> Sparky. <laughs> Just look at any of the Magic cards. They all look exactly the same. <laughs> They really do. Oh, I had my usual uh, argument after a leaf break with someone last night. I, I swear, I don't, I don't think my rules on leaf breaks are that hard. I go over them <laughs> in nauseam. 
Inevitably, somebody always has something to complain about. Uh, Dodger short print. About the uh, Jack Clark, for those of you that were here. Even though I says in the rules, and I very clearly state that retired players go to the team they play the longest with, I still have to have an argument with someone about it. I don't understand why they won't just, I guess it must have something to do with their, I don't know. I, I, I mean, like you see Panini, at least they'll put like New York or Philadelphia, or I guess Leaf isn't even allowed to do that. I, I've never asked them, like, what would be the harm in putting what city it is on the checklist, you know? I mean, not that I think the rules are wrong, and I basically follow the same rule everyone else does. All the breakers do it the same way, but inevitably there's always an argument afterwards with somebody. Uh, Arenado low numbered. That, oh, well, he played here too. Yeah, he did. But he only played there three years, and he played in the other team for 10 years. So Suzuki and Clark. Yeah, he played for the Giants the longest. That's who we went to. He he also played for the Yankees, the Cardinals, the Red Sox, and somebody else. Uh, Frank White, buyback for the Royals. But, I mean, it wasn't... Look, it gets into this whole thing with Leaf. Like, on the Jack Clark card, he's wearing a uniform that's red and white. So, somebody has the Cardinals or somebody has Boston. Well, the uniform, well, again, it doesn't say... You know, I mean, half of the cards that Paul Skeen's in, he's in an LSU uniform. So then who do you give it? You know, and the other thing you have to remember, if any of you have been in those breaks with me, I state all this at the beginning of every break. <laughs> I say it very clearly that it goes to the current team unless they're retired, then it goes to the team they played the longest with. But inevitably, somebody always argues about it. It's like, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what to tell you, man. Well, I, I think you should reword or this. And like, uh -huh. <laughs> uh, Bush Gardens flashback. I always think like, what if you were on the other side of this? If you were the guy that the card was going to and somebody else was, what would you think about it? Then? <laughs> I don't know. Look, I, I get people want to look out for themselves, and I'm not perfect. I've made mistakes in the past here and there a few times. <laughs> Dominguez, rookie. Um, so questioning is okay, but, I mean, when the, when the rules are that simple, like, when I'm, I'm, now I'm going to have to get into breaking down percentages of time spent on teams and, and randoming among, <laughs> like, all right, well, he spent 17% of his years with one team, and then he spent 52% with this team, so they'll get this many times in the random. Like, come on. I'm talking about baseball cards here. We're not curing cancer. Ah, there we go. There's something. Who's got the Cardinals? Craig. Mason Wynn, rookie auto. Very nice there. This kid's good. Finally, something to cheer about. Nice. Picked up the Cardinals for like 10 bucks, I think, on eBay, man. That'll cover. There you go, my friend. That's a nice looking card, too. I'll tell you, you can say a lot of things you want to say about Heritage, but real one autos are some of the best autos that get produced every year. On cards, usually cards are beautiful. That's a good one. Congrats, my friend. Them's the rules. <laughs> the funny thing is, though, like I went on, I, I went on Discord last night. We so I, I've told you guys before that all the certified eBay breakers, we have a Discord going. That's you know separate, and I put it up there. I was like, does everyone else deal with this? And they're all like, yeah, <laughs> every time. <laughs> like, okay, so it's not just me. <clears throat> hmm. 
Believe me, he was no, nowhere near as bad as the guy who was fighting with me about the, uh, um, oh, the, um, who was that? Um, oh, guy was fighting with me about this card. Satchel, was this Satchel Page? Yeah. Satchel Page. And for those of you who know, like, and it was the St. Louis spirit or whatever they were called and they have no affiliation with any team whereas like some of the some of those old teams have affiliations with uh and you know mlb teams like uh homestead with pittsburgh and stuff like that but <laughs> this guy was trying to tell me that matt mclean for the reds numbered 376 of 575 for adam and this guy, he was trying to tell me that he should go to the Nationals. And this was, again, the St. Louis Spirit card. And I was like, well, no, they, because we randomed it, which is exactly what we were supposed to do. Well, in, he starts telling me, Willie Adamas and Whiteboard, he starts telling me in like 2006 that the Nationals had adopted all those old teams and I said, what are you talking about? <laughs> like, <laughs> and I looked up what he was talking about. There was like, a, you know, I, I, they were doing like a museum for the old Negro League teams and stuff like that. And I guess, you know, somehow the Washington Nationals were, but this guy followed me for days about this. And I was like, but <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> like to the point where I almost gave in and bought another one just to shut the guy up. <laughs> and then somebody... The guy who actually won the card, I just asked him if he'd be interested in, if he would have any interest in selling it. Because I, I really considered, like, just, I had such a headache from this guy. And the guy was like, are you crazy? Why would you even consider this? He doesn't deserve a card. I'm like, yeah, you're right. What am I talking about? <laughs> the guy was wearing me down, I swear. Eventually, you just want people to stop saying something. <laughs> uh, Stanton, short print. Uh, Max Scherzer and Walker Bueller. Tommy Henry, low numbered. Hey, you can always rewind on the bottom, Andrew. The DVR's on the bottom. You just rewind back if you want. Dane rookie. Uh, Morgan and Soto then and now. Uh, I can't even remember, to be honest. Uh, Tom Cosgrove, low number. We have something. No, nothing. I don't think we have any Yankees yet. 
Uh, just uh, we had a seventy-five buyback Yankees in the first box. <laughs> uh, Stanton and Tovar. He was in the lineup, or he's playing tonight. Uh, Jose, I agree. Short print. Uh, Nestor Cortez, white border for the Yanks. You know, the other thing I felt like saying is like, you're arguing me over a Jack Clark card. <laughs> I don't want to, I'm not, you know, filing the guy's name or anything but we're, you know we're not talking about a $500 card here or anything <laughs> I don't know sometimes you have to put some put things in perspective a little bit you know uh, Morgan and Acuna <clears throat> Playing tonight at third night. Uh, Jake Rogers. Low number. Uh, Machado and Rom. Luciano rookie. Merrill Kelly, low numbers. Rookie box number four. And uh, hey, Jim Cat again. <laughs> it's time the box stopper to go with the auto. Look at that sixty eight to eighty three. Their lifetime three four five ERA, two eighty three and two thirty seven. It's not too bad. Not too shabby. We've had more autos out of this case in the first break than we had in the entire last case. <laughs> Reed, Olson. No, no hot box. Carlos Santana for the Brew Crew.
<laughs> Waves home are unfair. Get out. Get out. Sunny Gray, low number. Owls are rookie. Mookie. Jalen Carter, rookie. Campasano. Short for it. And Hunter Brown, white border short print for Houston. Kevin. Wait, what did you say? I watched enough of this being broke, and if it's a box topper, then it's a relic. Really? Um, hmm. I can't agree with that or disagree. And we've had more buybacks than box toppers. So I think in the last case, we had like four box toppers and eight buybacks. But again, in the last case, it's more shit. Excuse my language. All right, for the Bravos, numbered a 30 of 9.99 Acuna Refractor. For Jacob. But I guess we'll test your theory here, my friend. Nice Acuna. The Fall of Saigon. Yes, money grand doll. Well, I guess you're you're approved. There you go. <laughs> Jeff McNeil Clubhouse Collection for the Mets. For Rich. Oh wow, I didn't even is Rich even here? Jesus Christ. He's uh standing us up tonight, I guess. Jeff McNeil, the crybaby. Wow, you ran into me. <laughs> That's what uh Hoskins would say anyway. <laughs> Actually, like Jeff McNeil, De La Cruz rookie. That was the best. <laughs> when Hoskins was giving him the wah wah. Baller. Curtis Mead rookie. Mickey Ammoniac, short print. And Ben Joyce, white short print. Oh, for the Angels. 
Uh, for Bryce. You notice a little things like that. Juan Pablo Martinez, a rookie. Nolan Jones and Eloy. Uh, Aaron Judge, New Age Performers. Jordan. Harold Ramirez for the Rays. Short print. No, like I said, in the the in the case then plus that I've opened so far, it's they it seems to be one every two boxes. I would be interested. I mean, I brought it up earlier. I don't know if you're here yet, but in the heritage, anyway, the rookie seemed very limited. Uh, Dominguez is the same way. Henry Davis is the same way. Evan uh, Evan Carter is the same way. Like, I wonder if it's intentional or not. You know. I would have no problem with. Fanatic stops, whatever you want to call them, reducing some of the rookie card prints. We're being a little more scant with them. Because sometimes, especially in like, because I noticed it in Series 1, I brought it up before with Series 1, Luke Weaver short print, that there were certain guys who were plentiful. Um, Luciano and, and even Henry Davis in Series 1, there were a lot of but not always necessarily a lot of uh, De La Cruz or um, Dominguez. So, who knows? Uh, Ale Champs. Uh, Michael Soroka, short number. All right, last pack. Showing dice. And Osvaldo Cabrera. All righty. That is going to do it. All right, as always, I want to thank everyone for joining us this evening. Couldn't do this without y'all, and I do truly appreciate it, especially for those of you who go to our website and take advantage of our pricing over there. Most everyone will tell you you get stuff cheaper from the website than eBay after they tack on all their nonsense. Uh, we do have this one whiteboard, uh, Fred Lynn, Joe Morgan, between the Reds and the Red Sox that we got to roll a dice on. Get in the thing. All right. So uh, one, two, and three is Boston and Fred Lynn. Four, five, and six is Joe Morgan and the Reds. Dice must stay on the screen and can't hit anything. Like if it knocks into that, it's cracked and we'll roll it again. The T on here is the one. And good luck. Here we go. And it didn't stay on the screen. All right. Let's try again. There we go. Four. So it's going to the Reds. <clears throat> All righty. Let's 
Let's do a quick hit recap. Perfect. All right, hit recap for 2024 Heritage Baseball. Break 129 from the website. What time do we got? You know what? We got 8.51. We got a few minutes. So here's what I'm going to do. We like to do give, give stuff away when we're uh, doing website breaks. So how about we do this? Before we do a hit recap. We're going to give away uh, a blaster box of a big league to someone. Let me set it up real quick. We give away blaster boxes of Heritage, but I don't have a lot. They actually cut my allocation. So our break that we have up there is like all I have. So I won't be giving away a bunch of Heritage like we do with some other stuff. Let me see. Do, 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 do. Bear with me for a sec. Whoever wins, I'm not going to rip it. I'll send it to you shipped. You can do what you want with it. All righty. All right, so we're random seven times. Whoever comes out on top win a big league blaster box. Here we go. Good luck, everyone. One. Two. Six. And a lucky number seven. Here we go. The Padres. The Padres, my man Robert. There you go. The Padres are the winners. So Robert will send you out a blaster big league. Hopefully you'll find a little something in there. Congrats on the win, my friend. Uh, let's go. All right, so going out to the Padres. There you go. Congrats. All right, quick hit recap. Box toppers. We had a Jim Cat and Yogi Berra for the Mets. Uh, two of the Red Show and Dice error cards. Two De La Cruz and a Dominguez that I saw. If I missed any, we'll pull it out. In the... Oh, wait, no, there's, I'm sorry. There's another one over here. Other Dominguez there. Uh, these are all our short print. 
uh, low numbered short prints. We'll go through those and pull out any of the good guys and such. Uh, buyback box toppers, Elliot Maddox for the Yankees and Frank White for the Royals. Uh, white bordered short prints, Josh Jung, Bogarts, Soto, Adamas, Cortez, Brown, Joyce. And we had the duel, which went to the Reds on Rando. Uh, black border to 50, Anthony Descalfini for the Mariners. Uh, for the Braves to 9.99, Acuna. For the D-backs, Tommy Henry. Uh, for the Giants to 5.75, Logan Webb. And Matt McLean for the Reds. Uh, we had an image variation, Luis Matos, rookie for the Giants. And Kershaw, missing signature variation for the Dodgers. Uh, relics of Teoscar Hernandez and Jeff McNeil. We had a Jim Cat auto for the White Sox and a very delicious Mason Wynn rookie auto for the Cardinals. All right, folks, again, thank you so much for joining me. As always, uh, we're going to get set up for 1.30 here, so we'll be back in about five minutes, and we'll do that. Have a great night. Take care.